Florida and Georgia have key races for the U.S. Senate. Another race the nation is watching is in Pennsylvania, which could determine the balance of power. The candidates there met for the only time on a debate stage tonight. Former TV doctor Mehmet Oz and the state's former lieutenant governor John Fetterman, who survived a stroke in May, spent the night arguing and talking over each other. A one-hour debate in the U.S. Senate race for Pennsylvania. Republican Dr. Mehmet Oz against Democrat John Fetterman. The economy and taxes got things heated early, but personal attacks began immediately. When John Fetterman brings up houses, the irony is he didn't pay for his own house. He got it for a dollar from his sister, and he hasn't been able to earn a living on his own. He's lived off his parents. He got his... Pennsylvania right, House from his own inlays from Mr. A, a dollar. The candidates agreed that minimum wage in Pennsylvania is too low, but disagreed on how to increase wages without hurting businesses. They sharply disagreed on abortion policy. If you believe that the choice of your reproductive freedom belongs with Dr. Oz, then you have a choice. But if you believe that the choice for abortion belongs between you and your doctor, that's what I fight for. Roe v. Wade for me is should be the law. Lisa, I don't even need 30 seconds. I'll give you a bigger answer. I am not going to support federal, federal rules that block the ability of states to do what they wish to do. The abortion decision should be left up to states, and specifically when John Fetterman wants... You roll wants, with Doug Mastriano. John, when I'm done, can, John, you Both candidates discussed immigration, with Oz pointing to the increase in fentanyl deaths as a symptom of the issue. Fetterman points to China as America's biggest national security threat and criticized Oz for manufacturing products in the country. The discussion on the future of Social Security and even closing arguments were interrupted. Again, I just can't, I can't just say one thing other than that Dr. Oz would not support and he would support cutting Medicare and that's John effective. why do you it's, say it's, that it's, I've it's, never it's, said it's, that it's absolutely a fact it's a fact you <laughs> okay. would have voted against the the inflation uh, reduction act which has dropped our, our prescription drugs and oh. he doesn't believe okay gentlemen we need to move on the national polls have the race in Pennsylvania virtually tied Georgia and Florida each have one Senate seat on the ballot in the midterms as well